Oh, fancy seeing you here. You looking for a tier list? I got you. I got you. Oops, all flashbangs. <laughs> Ladies and gentle bitches, welcome back to the channel, HT Hayes. My name is Troy. Tier lists. I do them sometimes. I tend to dabble a little bit, maybe in an area that I'm not like super familiar with. And in two ways today, because we're doing a festival tier list. We're gonna be going through the most popular festivals and ranking them in the order of if we would go to them. Me personally and also chat. So Leah was so kind enough to make an incredible slideshow. Shout out to Leah. And it's gonna be starting off, I think, with Coachella. Ready for the reveal? Are you ready? Check this shit out, dude. Oh, oh my goodness. And here we have our first contender, Coachella. Thank you, shout out Leah for making all of these slides incredible. She went and found all these cute little stickers and she even included the ticket prices, which I thought was just gonna be interesting because personally, I've never been to a festival before. So this is kind of like me figuring out it's really gonna be like worth my money and then maybe if it's gonna be, uh, you know, uh, hit a couple different points. I just want to see like what's really gonna take it over the top. So I'm 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 interested. I'm 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 curious as to where these are gonna land me. I really honestly, what this really is is seeing if I if I if I know ticket prices. <laughs> okay, little nervous, little nervous. Okay, so with Coachella we have Lana Del Rey, How the Creator, Doja Cat, a ton of others I see around the sides. Jungle, Ice, Poor Blur. God. That was devastating. Actually, I felt so bad for them. I did see their Coachella set. Th these tickets have gotta be north of like a thousand for both weekends. Dude, ton of really great artists though, honestly. I mean, look, you get Sabrina, you get Doja, Jungle, Last Dinner Party, Chapel, Chap. Oh my God, don't even get me started. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say a thousand dollars. One thousand buckaroos, let's see. Okay, okay, hold on. Just one weekend. Yeah, okay, so I, th I feel like I was, oh my God, yeah, yeah. So so if you're getting the top, the very top, or e even the very bottom, you're at least spending $1,000. And then plane tickets to get there if you don't live in California, oh yeah. So would y'all still like recommend Coachella? Because here's, I feel like Coachella gets a, a bad rap for like rich kids getting in and blah, 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 and the crowd suck and all that stuff, but it's like, I don't know. If you're really like a music lover of like pop music, I feel like Coachella is kind of the place to be. If I was rich, I would 100% go, but no way in hell is that cheap. Yeah, I just don't think it's very cheap. I don't know. So in, in terms of the list, I feel like Coachella might be like kind of the perfect starting point. Should we go B? It's feeling it's feeling B because you get a ton of artists, a ton of really big hitters. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fair, 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 fair. Okay, B, B, let's go. Let's see who's going to be next. Who's going to be next? Lollapalooza. Oh, Lizzie McAlpine. Okay. We all also get Tyler again, Jungle again, SZA, oh my lord. Yeah, see I like this. This feels way more well-rounded to me. And how long is it? One through the fourth, so it's a four day long festival. Okay, what's the, what's the ticket sitch? What's the ticket sitch like though? What is the ticket sitch? What's the price? Okay, I'm hype. It's in my notes, but here's the thing. I gotta see how the days spread out. Like if Ryan's playing at the same time as like, like who? Chapel, Chapel's literally right there staring me in front of me. Do you realize how, how I would literally just mitosis myself, myself and goes to different direct, I'm sorry. I don't want to even put it in the air. The Japanese house, last dinner party. Okay, this is better. I think this is straight up just better than Coachella. I think this is like actually, I feel like this is okay putting into like A tier right now. Yeah, I'm putting, I'm putting Lola, Lols right here, A tier, say less. Anybody that I really don't want to see. <laughs> Any enemies on this list? Any enemies? Any any foes? Melanie Martinez? That's a foe. Okay, right there. <laughs> Here we go. Moving on. Next one. Glastonbury. Thank you, Leah. Thank you for 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 including this one. Just so I can say Glastonbury and have you be able to do it. Nothing about it. Incredible. Okay, who we got though? SZA. Remy. That's pretty good. Zuckerberg is also right there too. So that is a little concerning. Is he the funder? Is he like a, or is he like playing a set? It's slam poetry all about like X and Elon Musk. He backed down from a fight, but he soars through the skies. Call that fight or flight. Elon, Elon, gate your time in the zeitgeist. 
that Shania and Dula Peep? Coldplay, Shania Twain. Okay, big hitters, big hitters, big hitters. Arya Star too. Very cool. Okay, I'm seeing a trend. I'm seeing a trend of me kind of just like digging this. This doesn't give me too much though, I feel like. I don't know. How do we feel? This is a B. This is like clearly a B. I feel like if this is a B, then Coachella's gotta move to a C. Almost kind of want to just put Coachella in C just for simply putting like Sabrina and Chapel sets a little too close together. Like the 15 minute overlap that I heard about. Even that much. Unforgivable. Okay. C. In the UK, generally, we really disappoint with the headliners. I mean, it could be better. It could definitely be better. For sure. It could. I, 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 I see your point. Oh, oh, okay. Wednesday through Sunday. About 88 bucks a day, American. That's not bad, man. That's not bad. And you and you can still see SZA, Remy, Wolf. No, dude, that's pretty good, actually. I would say that's actually pretty dope. And they have some really cool smaller artists, too. Like, I see Soccer Mommy in here is good. We found her on the um, last small artist that we did. Yeah, this is giving B. This is giving B energy. I like this. I like this. Where are you? Glastonbury. Glastonbury with a B. Good job. Good job, UK. I actually, I actually, I actually kind of fuck with this. I actually kind of fuck with this shit. Who's next? Shaky knees, dude. Oh my goodness. Now this is where I feel like the woodland energy comes out because instantly Noah Khan hit the Barbie. Noah Khan specifically playing Barbie soundtrack songs. How the fuck can you not buy a ticket to this? I feel like I could go to this festival with my brother who's like seven years older than me and he'd like really fuck with it. Oh shit, and it's in Atlanta. Oh my God. Okay, sorry. Atlanta bias. Atlanta bias. Sorry. Here's the thing though. Atlanta will definitely gouge you. Atlanta will absolutely gouge you for the prices. So I would not be surprised if this was like still in the like 500s. Show me the number. Show me. Holy shit. Yeah, that, that, yeah. Yeah, that might be worth it. I am not mad about that. And they have the day split up too. A one day ticket would be worth it. It would be worth it for sure. I'm getting C energy though. Kind of C energy though. I just feel like there's some missed opportunities here. Yeah, this is kind of a C. This is kind of a C for me. Blonde Shell. I think I've actually heard of Blonde Shell. I should check out Blonde Shell. Maybe that's what I should do right now. Hold on. Since I'm not really like super familiar with this lineup, y'all think Blonde Shell would be cool? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I like it. You're right. You're right. That kind of rocks. All right. You know what? You just convinced me. I'm buying two days. I'm buying two days. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe even three for Foo Fighters. Three for Foo Fighters. Ladies and gentlemen, Foo Fighters. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Right up here with Lola. I think that's good. I think Lola, I think Lola might actually be too stacked. I'm going to move it up to S because I feel like we need a little bit of like a spread here. It just feels, it feels right to have the spread. At least right now with as, as little as we have. Maybe as we go on, we start to maneuver a few. But dude, Lola taking it right now. Shaky knees. Yeah. So yeah. So yeah, Atlanta. Yeah. Yeah. You did. You did a great job. Hell yes. Hell yes. And for that price, yeah, this is worth it. This is worth it. I'm going to hate the traffic. I'm going to absolutely want to shoot myself in the face for traffic. Moving on. Next one. Whoa. Okay. Is that Chris? <laughs> Wait a minute. Is that Chris? Is that JoJo? Wait. What? Wait a minute. What is this? Is this real? This is real. What is this? Wait, what is this? Hamilton? <laughs> What are you doing to me? What are you doing to me? Oh my God. Now that I'm thinking about this in like a realistic, like, oh, I would do this. I would have some time to chill. This is actually hell, hell. <laughs> a really hot male dancer from the Eras tour. You got One Direction back together for me. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You know, oh my God. I could die peacefully. <laughs> I could die peacefully. Dula Peep. Not Dua Lipa. Actually not Dua Lipa. But James, James Charles doing his Dua Lipa impression. Dude, I don't know what prices are gonna be like for this, but right now it's looking priceless. Wow. The people that sang Secret Tunnel from Avatar The Last Airbender. Yeah, that is a bop actually. You know what? If the set was just that for like 15 minutes, I wouldn't be mad. I might miss Chris's set though. I might have to dip out, brother. It's looking like a long day, you know? It's looking like a really long day. And um, I'm gonna have to dip. How much, how, how much? Not even a price. <laughs> you know what? You're goddamn right. It is priceless. That lineup is absolutely fucking priceless. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Where are you? Where are you? There you are, you son of a bitch. 
You know, actually, I don't think I'm, I, I think I might have to not attend. <laughs> I might have to not attend. I don't think my soul could take it. I don't think I could be hydrated enough for that festival. Uh, the amount of tears and busted knees and asses. Uh, I'd probably make it for like a good four hours and then I'd be really, really bummed that I couldn't stick around long enough for the rest of it. Oh man, no. But in terms of like actual, like, come on, like how could we, come on. I mean, now, now it actually makes sense. Now it actually makes sense. Coachella is not D, Coachella is C. This. This is appropriate. It's free and I'm not attending. No, it's priceless. It's priceless. No, that's an S tier. I'm attending. I'm 100% attending. <laughs> Moving right along. All things must go. <gasps> okay. This one popped up on my Instagram timeline recently. It's going to be an MD. What the fuck is MD? I should know this. I'm an American citizen. MD. Mondana. No. Maryland? Where's the D in... Oh, well, yeah. Okay, Maryland. Yeah, so the lineup. Oh, 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 holy shit. Oh, Remy, Wolf, Ethel Kane, Julian Baker. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is wonderful. Yeah, this is actually fantastic. Personally, I would give this an A tier. I would I would put this up, 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 right there with Lola. Yep, that's where you belong. Tickets? Excuse me. Excuse me. All things go is right because count my bitch ass in. And you're still on the East Coast, so I don't have to worry about like jet lag. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Boston's calling. <laughs> Ed, what are you doing up there, bro? Don't you talk to me or my son ever again. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We got Hozier as well. Also, off brand generic Hozier, David Kushner, Chapel Roan, babe. Chapel. Dude, Chapel's making the rounds, dude. Oh my God. Every time I see Chapel's name and it's like a little bit bigger. Mm, she just had her debut. Yeah. If I don't, if I don't see her at least one time, I will be in a deep, dark place this is cool this is fine i'm it's it's kind of i don't know but i i i i just don't think i'm gonna go I, it's not it, it's for somebody it's not for me it's just not for me i don't know maybe we'll maybe we'll well i'll be nice d it's good yeah d boston is calling i don't i might not be answering i might go let it let it go to voicemail just let it go tickets Okay, dude, Shaky Knees is less expensive and it's got a better lineup, so I don't even know. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Nah, I'm good. I'll pass. Oh, shit. Rock is back, baby. All right, let's see who we got. Dua Lipa. Nice. Dua Lipa, what are you doing here? Dua Lipa, what are you... Where? Okay. Mark Ribier? Mark. Oh, dude. Dude, I might just go for Mark. We got Greta, first day. That's cool. Uh, Black Pumas, too. Pretty cool. It looks like the sixth is like a pop day. It's like a, it's like, it leans a little bit more pop. Still rock energy. Still rock energy. Because you got the kooks. You got the last dinner party. But yeah, Dua Lipa, tight, tight. Avril Lavigne. Oh, man. Angela might want to go to this one. And she'd be like, it'd be a time to travel abroad. She'd literally convince me. Nobody show her. Don't do it. But this looks fun, though. Genuinely, this does look fun because you also get jungle on the last day with Foo Fighters and Zara Larson, which is just a wonderful live artist as well. And then Sampa. How much though? Without including plane tickets? Okay. No, not bad. Not that bad. You get a lot. You can get a lot in here. You can have a really good time at this festival. This is like actually like a B. I actually feel really good about this festival because depending on who you are, you can kind of just hit like two days if you wanted to, but then it's $1,200 a piece on plane tickets there. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. For me personally, I'm giving it a D. I'm, so, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I can't. I can't. I can't do that. Actually, no, I'll, I'll do, I'll do C. I'll do C. Actually, no, I'll do B. No, I'll do B. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know. How do we feel? Should we do a poll before we get into the next one? Let's do a poll. B? We said B? Okay. It's B. It's B. We did B. Okay, nice. Thank you for being ahead of the game. What is next? Holy shit. This looks emo as hell. What does that even say up top? Hinterland? Winterland? Winterland? Winterland Festival? Hinterland. Okay, okay. What's the lineup looking like? Three days. Hozier, Vampire Weekend, and Noah. Okay. Thank you for putting Noah and Lizzie on different days. I would have cried. 
damn. Oh, man. And see, that's so sad for me because I know Lizzie is not coming to Atlanta for the older tour, which is just heartbreaking. But she is hitting these festivals, dude. Oh, that's like the... Oh, dude, I'm sorry. That's like the only artist I would go to. Dude, Hozier, I've probably seen somewhere. And genuinely, I don't know. It, it's not like a big pull for me. But Lizzie kind of is, though. And that whole second day or that whole third day is stacked. Ethel Chapel Japanese House Last Dinner Party. Mm. Oh. Yeah, see, got me by in two days, man. If, if you were about this life, which I know a lot of people are still, I feel like one day would have been fine. For this one, one day is fine. I'm not going crazy over it. Um, Unlike Lizzie over here. <laughs> I won't go crazy. What are the tick, what's, what's the ticketing look like? Oh man, that might just be worth it though. I do have to go to Iowa though, Iowa. I'm in Nebraska. Come say hi. That's okay. It is a location. <laughs> it is a location. Could be super low key though. This could actually be like kind of like the fest, the underrated festival lineup. It's just not, I don't know. Eh, 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 Hinderland. Hinderland I'm kind of giving. It's, 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 it's D. What is, what is chat saying? What's chat saying? A? A? Who's voting? Who's voting A for Hinderland? We got a lot of like Midwesterners out there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I will put some respect on, on your potatoes. I am sorry. A. A for chat. You know, we got to split the diff, man. We got to split the diff. You're going A. I'm going D. I'll give it a C. I'll go C. Because of chat, I'll go C. I will respect the poll a little bit. But okay, who's next? Whom's is next? Hangout Fest. Hell yeah, brother. Let's go. Or I don't know. Maybe. My eyes directly just go to chain smokers and I, I, I'm completely, completely taken out. You got Sexy Red, NLE Choppa, Dochi, Alice in Wonderland, EDM shit, Chapel, Renee, Dominic Fike. Dude, Chapel's going crazy. Oh shit, Hemlock! <gasps> A mutual! Hello! Okay, maybe this is, I think this might actually be worth it. Seeing Hemlock actually kind of might get me interested. Chat, I'm feeling like a like a B on this. Okay, so someone here says that they've been to Hangout and it is really small. Mmm. Okay. Okay. C. Yeah, yeah, I'll agree. I'll agree. I feel like that's, that is appropriate. That's appropriate. C for Hangout Fest. Kind of got me on the back end, but I just don't know. Well, let's see how much the, let's see how much the tickets are. Just a $300. Yeah. It's still, I feel like it's still on the lower end, but then you do also have to go to Alabama, which I can just like, confidently tell you is just not where you really want to kind of be so yeah chapel what are you doing going to alabama <laughs> what are you doing dude she's going there to liberate the gay youth yes let's go what's the where, where, where are we at with the next one? Oh shit reading leads god damn headlining huge we get lana again blink again fred also again 21 Savage as a special guest on Sunday. It looks like a lot of pop, some rap. Viagra boys? <laughs> what? Okay, might go, might go for them. Honestly though, Ray is really like the only one I feel like I'd have a very strong connection to on, on day two. The last dinner party is gonna eat up that set as well. They're gonna, they're gonna kill that shit. This is like a C for me. I don't know, but I'm also kind of like taking a point off because I don't love the... <laughs> The graphic design. Oh. The graphic design for this one is not getting me. Not feeling the graphic design on this one. Yeah, it's looking like C's gonna gonna be taking it. Yeah, yeah. I think C's, I think C's gonna take it. Why don't we do it? So yeah, this is this is kind of ending up being how I thought it would kind of be. Like a very small section of these are like actually gonna be worth it. A lot of them trying to cover a lot of bases that end up kind of just not having a whole lot of like focus. Blink and Jerry, Lana Fred, Liam Catfish. Oh, look at that price jump for Lana and Fred. They know, they know, they know the pop girlies. They have the dough. Yeah, we can take it 405 and the plane ticket. If you live in the States to this, yeah. I don't know. I, I would wait for a better lineup. This just, it just doesn't seem worth it for the, for the American. Sorry, speaking from my bias, but you know, it is what it is. Last one, Govies. Government ball. Jesus was a carpenter. Yes. Chapel, do we get chapel? Where's chapel? No, she's right there, day three. Okay, we get Chapel. We get Sabrina Carpenter. We get Barack Obama with Ryan Beatty. Yeah, okay, holy shit. This is in New York too. So we're staying East Coast. It's in June. God, it's gonna be so hot. Carly, Posty, 
SZA, Claire Rosencrans. This is looking good. I like the graphic design. I do. What's the pricing though? We got options. We have options. The government, you know what, God damn it. Just because it's tax season, the government, they owe me this. They owe all of us this. Flushing Meadows. That's not a, not a great name, but it's okay. It's, they still owe us. They still owe us. Not bad. Not bad, dude. And that is gonna be it. Oh my goodness. Okay, where are we, where are we at? This is too good. This is, this, yeah, this is, that, yeah, that's, that's, that's A. That's it. I don't think, I don't think anything's gonna be, <laughs> let's be honest. Okay, let's be real with ourselves. What is beating Hamilton? What is going to beat Hamilton? <sighs> okay, well then it's gonna have to share its spot with like governor's ball, okay? <laughs> okay, it's this. This is it. This is the completed 2024 festival tier list. Actually, very informative and educational. I, act I, I wanna run a few of these by Angie just to see if she's like maybe down to, uh, you know, go. Thank you. Thank you, chat, for coming and experiencing this, being a part of this entire thing. You might see me there. If we get an okay from the wife, let me know in the comments which ones you're going to. What's worth the money? And just like that, it's 2007. But that is gonna be a wrap for your boy. But as always, make sure you're staying happy, healthy, and strong. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.